Hey guys, I'm Andre. I'm Elton. This is ATV. And we haven't done one of these in a while because we yeah, haven't put, has... yeah, put it out in a while, but we're seeing a new Overwatch character. Yeah, the last one was Sigma, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Sigma was the last one, which his introduction was nine videos, months ago, I think. His, yeah, and his introduction video was weird, but it was cool. Yeah. He's a cool character. Mm. He's a tank, he's a his tank abilities and then the balls and playing him a lot. Yeah. I'm not that great at him. Especially his ball. I can't do it properly. Yeah, well, but uh now we're seeing Echo, which we've seen in uh the McCree. McCree. Not with Ash, I guess. No. Uh it was technically McCree's short, but introduced yeah. Ash as a character, but then the guy was like, oh, there's Three other people who could be playing, or four people: Ash, Bob, those like rogue dudes, or the new uh, robot Probably Echo, like and they're like, well, two of them are, and it was Bob and Ash, and like, they're a combo. And, I won't and like, everyone knew this one was gonna yeah. become one, become like one, because literally, they people were asking for it to be like, uh, what was her name? The, the robot? Athena. Athena, yeah. And like you saw like the body and stuff, and she was in like the original artwork. But um, people thought it was Athena. She looks different in this, anyway. Yeah. But it, it's someone, a different robot. And you know what? Let's just go and find out who she is. Yeah. Is because we could talk besides the McCree, we have no idea. We could talk a lot about everything else later. Mm -hmm. So, go. <laughs> He didn't play. I don't have to worry about the audio. Yeah, they were showing. I forgot to see. They were showing uh, stuff on Twitter, like file, like a file or something with this person. I think I saw something like Professor Milo, I think or something. They had every Help us fight. And only Overwatch believed. Does she help me? You are my life's work. You will be everything I dreamed. So all I wanted. All I needed was to help the world. So she like uh and she created me. Yeah, like Earth defenses. Oh, that's it? Oh, that's it? Oh, I didn't think, did they say the name? They say the name on the... It she looks pretty cool though. Yeah, she looks cool. Uh, like but, uh... It, it, it's weird, because she kind of has parallels to, um... Oh, uh, what's her name? Moira? What's the thing like Overwatch, like, set like this? But, unlike her, where she she created the Omnics, it seemed like that scientists created yeah. the Omnics. And, uh, or at least helped create yeah. something. Yeah, it helped her. Yeah. Yeah, I think it was just she, she even said that I created the Omni. And, like, but Overwatch saw my potential. So, like, where in it, it was that Overwatch didn't, like, from Moira, Overwatch didn't see her potential, but Blackwatch did. Yeah. And I went to Talon, where her, so her was like, she, she did, she made, tried doing something good, it turned out bad. And then, uh, well, the other one, the other one was helped. the other one. Well, Moira was doing something kind of bad, and it just had good properties yeah. that helped. And, and, like not bad, but what she thought was good, which is kind of bad. But it also had good properties to go with it. Mm -hmm. Well, this one, it was like some, she was doing something good that turned bad, but she's still trying to make them both got help from two different organizations. Well, Blackwatch was technically still the same orange, but after it went to Talon. So it's like, you could kind of see parallels in it, but okay. obviously the scientist is not the the hero, because yeah. I'm guessing something happened to her. Uh -huh. Another a big thing too is that it's like, if this was a movie, she would be like 
Deus Ex Machina, I feel like, like throughout the whole story, she would be maybe not as much useful as she would be at the end of it, be the Earth's protector, because that's what it seems like. Like, Overwatch is all supposed to be about for her. Yeah. It's weird. Like, you don't get a, you didn't get a scene much, though. Which is kind of weird. Yeah. Like, a lot of these like, short. Like, they're not even shorts. It's a, last time when every hero came out, it was a short and with it. Yeah, now, it now it has just only been origin these stories. Origins. But, like, the origin stories don't even tell you anything. And, like, and honestly, it just, like, do. lately, even Overwatch isn't telling you anything. Like, the website, the comic. Like, they're not. Which is. They're sad. very much slowing down. Yeah, which is sad, but... The one thing I do... Oh, honestly, I literally just... I literally, like, an hour before this was watching Tin the Tan Man on Twitch. He was doing the abilities. He was checking her out with Jeff the Overwatch team. The Jeff. Jeff. So I know how she plays because they we would put that in the video, but they don't have that out yet for some reason. They don't have her abilities video out. Oh, explain it to me, because I, I didn't watch it. She's that. pretty crazy, actually. Like, uh, her regular, her regular, uh, click, uh, left click is, uh, these, uh, what, I don't know what they call them. Just, projectile? yeah, they're like, kind of projectile that she shoots from her, like, fingers. It says, like, five projectiles, it's go, it's so, like, so, two it's kind of like it it's looks. Shocking. It seems more like it looks more or it feels kind of like the sigmas, like where the balls are just like that. Because they're not little; they're like kind of like orbs and things that go out and just like like one big shotgun. Not shotgun spread, but like focus shotgun thing like, like mm -hmm. that. And uh, her right click is uh, sticky bombs. They just go and it's like a lot of them. A lot of sticky bombs. Yeah, and, and so it's a few, like a couple of them, just goes and then they actually just it's like you can move while doing it. So oh, you like that. Sound of that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and uh, so it's cool. Apparently, they're it's good. You can put them on shields and stuff like that to break them down, which goes into her next ability. Her E is a a beam. It's like literally just. Kind of like Symmetra's old beam, almost, and things like that. But it, a special thing about this is that there's two things about it. Uh, if you're doing it to someone that uh, has full health, it's not that great, but it melts almost anything that even shields that are half health. It'll like destroy that. So, so, uh, so it's it gets like a buff on like. Half damage. So, yeah, when, it, when anything's half damaged, it will literally like just melt that down completely. That's not fun. Well, I'm guessing it's because she, like with the sticky bombs and all that, I'm guessing she's supposed to be uh, a shield breaker. She's supposed to, like she's supposed to be the solution to help everyone, all the barriers being in this game and things like that. Uh, yeah, it works on characters. It oh, kind yeah. of seems like oh. <laughs> I'm almost dead, and then like if she's a, a play of played, then it's like oh I'm almost dead now, and then I'm dead now. Yeah. Uh, the th uh, I almost I literally forgot like one of the biggest things too is that she can fly. Like actually like, fly? Or no. Like mercy. Or it's it's mercy and Thor basically together. Like they're basically together, so she can shoot off. Well, the thing is hers. It's different. She can uh, just as Vera can only go off when you press the button. She will go the direction you put it. So it'll do a boost in any direction. So if you push back, she'll go up back like that. And if you press forward, if you go up space, she'll just go straight off. The forward side, she'll like fly, go that way, and then she glides down. Like uh, not as slow as Mercy, but if you hold a uh, shift when she's going down, it'll. She'll glide, but I think it's space. I don't know. I don't remember, but uh, she'll glide down, so you can literally shoot people from above. And so, and they were literally showing that with the cooldown how it is right now, 
she can basically stay in the air indefinitely because it, it like if you make if you maneuver if you do it at a certain point place it'll basically come down before you touch the ground somewhere like if it's on a lower platform it'll basically come down before you touch the ground so you can do it jump back up again and see so you can stay in the air so indefinitely. it's kind of like far though because i think yeah if you play far or right you can stay they, i think they they uh what is it called? They nerfed it as far as a bit, where she can't do it. Like she's on the ground for at least maybe two seconds. Oh, I don't know, because I haven't seen it. Uh, I think you still can if you're really good. You say, but, I'm, but I think they have nerfed that one. But uh, then there's her alt, which is just the craziest thing. I'm curious. Uh, her alt is that you can target an enemy, uh, uh, enemy team's hero out of all the six ones they have on their team obviously unless they're echo and uh duplicate you can become that person for 15 seconds that's kind of interesting. yeah you can become the it's like it's like a green grid version of them like a darker blue than her face kind of it's all like that and it's them and uh they do more damage and gain alt faster so literally, well, you can like literally from when they're shot from over there, you can literally get your ult like twice as them when the echo is them before the uh, 15 seconds are up. It can get ult twice. Yeah, like if you're if you're hitting enough people and getting, you can literally get your like, ult twice. I kind of want to see it. That's crazy. <laughs> like they said, they're obviously gonna tweak that. Like they're gonna tweak her numbers and stuff like that when once she hits the PTR because mm -hmm. yes right now she seems pretty crazy the, like her damage when she was doing that her regular attack was do is pretty high what? and then with the floating what is her like HP like if she's twenty it's two hundred so like Trace it's a bit Trace is like one fifty a bit high hers is a bit oh. higher than Trace it's not a bad Trace but she's Oh yeah, and when she's th this one is the weirdest thing to me was that when she transforms into someone, if she dies as that person, she doesn't die. She becomes Echo again. Huh? That was one of the that's a weird thing to me. I don't yeah. know why they did that. Really? Like it's because she doesn't die as them. So if you're like Roadhog, you'll get all the Roadhogs. If, like if she's dying, I don't. I should have checked this more closely. I don't know what happens to her health yeah, after so. she ults because her because uh, her ult because when she becomes the person she gets the full health of that character so she'll get 500 of like Roadhog's HP. I don't know what happens when she reverts back. I don't think she gets full oh, HP. No, well that's what I was gonna well, ask. Well, no, does yeah, she get her she, HP? So you can literally use it as like a self uh, self preserving so, mechanism or something to not die. I, I, yeah, that's kind of, you could become someone and run away. I don't, and I don't know like if she that. gets her health back or not. I don't think so. But yeah, and she can't if she does die, man, she still becomes Echo, not doesn't die as the if she's another character like Tracer. If someone if she becomes Tracer and someone kills her as Tracer, she'll become Echo again. She's just there. Yeah, like like the all just ends. Yeah, basically, like she doesn't go back to the resort. She's point, pretty you know? crazy. I, yeah, that doesn't. I don't get like, why. If they have the same health like, yeah. and do more damage, it kind of seems like, oh, I killed them, so it should, I should have earned that kill then. Yeah, it's it's that one to me is a bit weird. I don't really get why they did that. But uh, another thing, obviously, a big thing people are kind of upset about is that she's a DPS. Which this game does not need more right now. Of. Yeah, with the fact that they changed, I could obviously I've played since then. Since they did that, I had played a couple. They had a like, roll queue. Yeah, which, which is like, and now they've added, uh, uh, what are they? hero, hero pools. That's what it is. I, I know it's bans, basically, but they added hero uh, pools, which is literally they'll ban four characters now in competitive. Oh, yeah, I think I've heard of that. Which, and it's like, tanks and healers barely have any characters left in the thing and you're banning them. And they literally banned two healers this week. And I was just like, like, what? 
<laughs> Are you crazy? I don't know if it's this weekend. I don't know. It's like... It was like... What if it's a character that you, that you like to play or... I think, I can't, I'm guessing it's to try and stop those like one tree thing. Yeah. But like... It's, the, it's, Overwatch is not its best state, most people would say right now. Yeah. But yeah, it's like... Oh, it's so a lot, that's why a lot of people were angry that she's DPS. I, me, me as well, I also thought she was going to be a support character, a lot of people did. But she's yeah. DPS, which is kind of shocking. Her abilities are really unique and cool, by the way. Yeah, it's... Yeah. I mean... I, I think it's cool having, like... Uh, I don't know, I guess, um... An Omnic DPS, in a way that it's like... That looks like that, that you think would be a support. But... Thanks. Yeah, you need more support in tanks because they're literally like I think. Tanks I think if you add, barriers, that's what I think, think if you add, if you add literally, uh, what is it called like the tanks and hero or healers or supports, I guess tanks and supports, it still doesn't match up how much DPS there are. Mm. It's like it's crazy, and to add roll queue to that is like you. Mm -hmm. Like, everyone's gonna be DPS because there's so much more wide range for DPS, and okay. that's also why when you're DPS, the queue times are insane. And, and isn't that even in Overwatch 2 that new hero? Are they not there the DPS? Uh, I don't think they've confirmed. Some people have actually said that, which is even worse. Uh, well, right. Jeff said that they're working on a huge amount of uh, tanks and supports. Like, well, that's still gonna have, be forever from yeah, the time, time, Considering how long it took them to get this from the other one, what is the game gonna be working on for like five more years? Yeah. Like, are people gonna be playing by then? Even in five years, that's maybe like. Actually, that'd be like 20 years. Yeah, maybe like 20 years. If you, it seems like they're releasing in three models. Well, recently it's been like two. It's so yeah. gonna be like, to be like six characters. So for like five years, that's one of the most expensive things to do. So, it's been going like slow. Yeah. But yeah, well, we've talked a lot. Yeah. All right. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and hit that ding notification bell to get notified when our videos come out. And why don't you leave a comment on any series of videos you want us to watch? Well, that's it. See ya.